The upcoming Galaxy S25 series is anticipated to incorporate advanced 3M chips, with variations depending on the region. Certain models may be equipped with the Exynos 2500, while others will feature the Snapdragon 8 Gen 4, which is set to be unveiled in October 2024. This powerful Snapdragon chip is expected to give the Galaxy S25 Ultra a competitive edge over the iPhone 16 Pro Max in terms of performance. Globally, the Galaxy S25 Ultra is likely to utilize the Snapdragon 8 Gen 4, whereas the Galaxy S25 and Galaxy S25 Plus may come with either the Exynos 2500 or the 8 Gen 4 contingent on the market. Recently, the Snapdragon 8 Gen 4 made its debut in the Geekbench database, showcasing its potential to enhance the Galaxy S25 Ultra's performance against the iPhone 16 Pro Max. In initial tests, the 8 Gen 4, when paired with 12 gigs of RAM, achieved impressive scores of 2884 in single-core and 8840 in multi-core benchmarks on Geekbench 6. These results are comparable to the iPhone 15 Pro Max, which scores approximately 2900 in single-core and 7237 in multi-core tests. Notably, the Snapdragon 8 Gen 4 demonstrates a significant improvement of 35% in single-core and 30% in multi-core performance compared to its predecessor. It's important to note that early chipset tests often utilize reference devices running non-final software, which can lead to lower performance metrics. Therefore, once the Snapdragon 8 Gen 4 is integrated into consumer-ready devices with more than 12 gigs of RAM, we can expect a notable boost in CPU performance. The upcoming iPhone 16 Pro series is expected to introduce a chip that may not significantly enhance CCPU performance compared to its predecessor. This opens the door for the Galaxy S25 Ultra, powered by the Snapdragon 8 Gen 4, to potentially rival or even surpass the iPhone 16 Pro Max in terms of CPU capabilities. On the graphics front, the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3 has already outperformed the iPhone 15 Pro Max's 6-core GPU, suggesting that the Adreno 830 in the 8 Gen 4 is likely to maintain this advantage and outperform Apple's new chip in graphics processing. Apart from this, Samsung has officially kicked off the mass production of the slimmest mobile device memory chips in the world, designed to enhance on-device ag capabilities in smartphones while maintaining an impressively compact size. These innovative 12 nanometer DDR5X RAM chips measure a mere 0.65 millimeters in thickness, yet they boast a higher density and improved heat resistance, making them ideal for the demanding requirements of future mobile AI applications. Samsung has indicated that these sleek, high-capacity chips are tailored for the intensive tasks that on-device AI will necessitate in upcoming smartphones. It's likely that these RAM chips will be featured in the upcoming Galaxy S25 series, with hints suggesting that the Galaxy S25 Ultra will indeed offer an increase in RAM. The new 12 in memory chips, which are thinner than a credit card, will be available in 12 gigs and 16 gigs configurations, lending credence to the speculation that the Galaxy S25 Ultra will debut with an impressive 16 gigs of RAM, a first since the Galaxy S21 series. The debate over the exclusive launch of Apple Intelligence on the premium iPhone 15 Pro models highlights the crucial role of RAM in executing AI tasks. Craig Federi from Apple has essentially indicated that the reason the iPhone 15 and 15 Plus miss out on this feature isn't due to a slower processor, but rather their 6 gigs RAM limitation, as the minimum requirement for Apple's AI capabilities appears to be 8 gigs. To address this, Apple plans to introduce 8 gigs RAM in the upcoming iPhone 16, marking the first time a budget model will feature this upgrade. Meanwhile, Samsung, a leading manufacturer of memory chips, is able to equip its devices with double that RAM, specifically optimized for AI functions. However, production for the S25 series is still on the horizon, which means that these advanced chips may initially be utilized in flagship Android devices from other manufacturers set to launch this fall. Apart from this, Samsung has been diligently developing its VR headset, with recent insights from Business Insider indicating a potential launch by late 2024 or early 2025. There are whispers that the design and features of this VR headset may influence the upcoming Galaxy S25 series, as suggested by the well-known Tipster Ice universe. Collaborating with Qualcomm and Google, Samsung is exploring innovative possibilities for its VR technology. 
While the tipster hints at shared design elements between the next Galaxy flagship and the VR headset, specific details remain elusive. Reports from Sammobile suggest that Samsung might provide a Gear VR-like experience, where the smartphone acts as the power source for the headset. However, current leaks imply that the VR headset will function as a standalone device, equipped with its own power and processing capabilities, similar to the Apple Vision Pro. Speaking of Apple, their offering has not only been pricey, but has also somewhat fallen short of expectations. It will be fascinating to see if Samsung, alongside Google and Qualcomm, can deliver a more enticing product to capture the market's interest. New information hints that the external design of the XR will bear a resemblance to the S25 series, suggesting a potential departure from the design that the S25 series has maintained for the past few years. Speculation is rife that the Galaxy S25 series will finally introduce a fresh design, distinguishing it from the Galaxy S23 and S24 series. However, there have been no reliable renders or concept images of the Galaxy XR released yet, making it challenging to visualize the appearance of this head-mounted device. Furthermore, the rumors surrounding Samsung's anticipated design overhaul for its upcoming S-Series flagship lineup, which is set to share features with the XR device, add another layer of uncertainty to how the headset might ultimately look. The Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra stands out as one of the top flagship Android smartphones released this year. Despite not being flawless, it boasts an impressive anti-reflective screen, exceptional performance, and long-lasting battery life. However, its 200 megapixels main camera and telephoto lenses fall short compared to the competition. Recent rumors indicate that the Galaxy S25 Ultra may feature an upgraded 50 megapixels 3x telephoto sensor, which would significantly enhance image quality and detail compared to the S24 Ultra's smaller 10 megapixels 3x telephoto lens. Samsung has been utilizing the same sensor in its flagship models since the Galaxy S21 Ultra launched in 2021. However, it seems the primary sensor might remain unchanged, continuing with the 200 megapixels sensor found in both the S24 and S23 Ultra. Additionally, a Samsung VP touched on the company's advancements in AI, revealing plans to collaborate closely with partners like Google. This collaboration aims to improve the understanding of conversational context, ultimately delivering a more seamless and natural user experience across devices. With these enhancements, Samsung is poised to strengthen its already significant advantage in AI integration over its rivals. So, what are your thoughts on these upcoming upgrades in the Galaxy S25 lineup? Share your opinions in the comments below and stay tuned for more updates on our channel. Take care until next time. Peace out.